Hey guys, how's it going? I just want to share a quick video with you guys on how to frame sports jerseys. As you can see behind me, I've got a few hanging up. This is actually my personal collection here. Very proud of them. But uh, it's ve actually very simple to do. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to do that in this video here. I know Christmas is around the corner, so this could be a great gift idea for that special someone. Um, but uh, let me go ahead and show you how to hang up your sports jersey. Here's the thing about framing jerseys. It can get real expensive really quick. I mean, if you take it to a, if you, first of all, if you have the jersey, that's great. But if you're buying your jerseys, that's one cost you got. But if you take it to a frame shop or an art shop, uh, I've got quotes as little as 300, but as much as 500. Uh, dollars. So, I mean, you can see it get, it'll get really expensive if you have a couple jerseys. But I'm going to show you an inexpensive way uh, to frame a jersey, and it looks just as nice. In my opinion, it looks better than the one that you just saw uh, in, in front of uh, on the intro that I did to this video. That was actually given to me uh, my senior year at Auburn. They gave all the seniors that. But this, I'm going to show you this frame. Um, I like it uh, even more, and it's a lot more affordable and easy to do. So, uh, check it out. Alright, so this is how the frame is going to come in a box if you order it off of my website. Uh, this is the extra large frame right here, and this is the extra deep. So really the only difference in size is just one just a little bit thicker. They come in four different sizes, extra deep, extra large, large and small. So I just wanted to open them in front of you so you can see what you're going to be getting when you get them, and how they're shipped, and how they're packaged. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and unbox them, and uh... You can check them out when I get them out, all right? Beautiful, man. Beautiful, beautiful. All around. <laughs> so I'll show you a finished product after I hang these up. And of course, you can get these on my website, yougoprobaseball.com. So there's two ways to hang your jersey in the shadow box. One is with these straight pins, and the other is on a hanger. At the top of the shadow box, there's a little hook, and all the shadow boxes come with a hanger as well. Uh, so you can just hang it from that hook, and it looks really great. Uh, or, as in this short clip that I'm showing you, you can pin it using straight pins. Uh, if you don't have a thimble, that's okay. You can use a soda cap top, just like I got here. Uh, just get the jersey straight and pin it in where you feel necessary. Um, so it works out great. We have a bunch of different options for these shadow boxes as well. As you can see here, it comes in a cherry color, but we also offer it in an oak, a walnut, or a black color. The felt color, as you see here, is red, but you can also get that in a black or a white background color. The wireless LED lights come in a silver, black, or gold finish. The gold you have to get with the remote. The black comes with or without the remote, and the silver you can only get without the remote. The lights add a real nice look to it when it's dark out. You can also get a matching 8x10 frame that matches the same color as the bigger frame. As for a cleaning kit, you can either get the starting kit or the maintenance kit. And the engraving plate comes in a few different options. A 3 by one inch solid brass, a 3 by one inch gold text on a black plate, 3 by one inch silver text on a black plate, 4 by 2 inch solid brass, a 4 by 2 inch gold text on a black plate. And you can get those in a few different corner styles with a square corner, a round quarter, or a notched corner, and you can get those in a few different text types. Aerial, Book, Courier, Impact, Script, or Times New Roman. I hope this clears up any questions you guys may have. The jerseys are on sale right now on the website, yougoprobaseball.com, for a limited time right now. So go get them, and if you have any questions, please don't feel afraid to ask. I'll help answer any questions the best I can. Thanks, guys.